Hey guys, today I want to talk about sex addiction. This is a term that gets thrown around a lot in the gay community, and it's usually targeted towards people who have a lot of different sex partners, or who engage in kinky or fetish style sex, or pretty much anything that is outside of the realm of normal sexual behavior. Now, this in and of itself does not make you or anyone else a sex addict. Sex addiction is considered a behavioral addiction, something similar to, let's say, shopping or gambling. However, unlike shopping and gambling, sex is a very natural, normal, and instinctive part of being a human. So even experts in this field have yet to agree exactly on what constitutes sex addiction. So it is not currently listed in the DSM-5 as an addiction. However, many and many and most mental health professionals will treat sex addiction. So I myself am not qualified to diagnose sex addiction. However, I've done a lot of research on this topic. And from what I've seen, most experts would agree that there are four signs that can tell you that you're within the realm of an addiction. So I'll share those with you now. Number one, you knowingly put your physical health and the physical health of your sexual partners in jeopardy. Number two, you are unable to control or stop your sexual urges even when you want to. Number three, you knowingly hide and conceal your sexual behavior. And number four, your sexual behavior interferes with your day-to-day -day life and relationships. So if any of these sound like they hit a bit close to home, I can certainly put you in contact with some amazing resources and potentially some people who will be able to help you. Just send me a DM and we'll have a confidential private conversation and I can even help you um, determine where you fit along this spectrum. And I'll share the resources that I have on my end. So that's all I got for you guys today on the topic of sex addiction. Keep in mind, just because you enjoy lots of different kinds of sex with lots of different kinds of people does not necessarily make you a sex addict. Of course, there are other risks associated with that behavior, but that is the topic for another day. Thank you so much and be well.